oh, you're a music major, but you have D's and F's in your music classes from last semester. Why is that? And I was like, it wasn't my... Okay, so everywhere I film, either the lighting's good or the background's bad. So I chose good lighting over a cute background. So, oh, maybe I can film like this. My darling, I love you, 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 I love you. I had pre-filmed a video for today. It was little get ready with me, but I don't think I'm going to upload it. I kind of want to just upload this video. It's going to be a gratitude video pretty much because today, well, okay, let's start with last week. Last week I had registration, which was on the 13th. And like three days before I was like, oh my God, I forgot that I had missed my counseling appointment. And before summertime and I was like I need to set up a counseling appointment so I called the counseling office and asked if I could set up an, appoint an appointment and they said that they are booked all the way up until school starts and I was like oh, what and the girl was like if you want to you can call tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. and see if there's any cancellations maybe we can squeeze you in somewhere and so I called the next morning at 8 a.m. and there was um, some openings on Monday which is today and so I was able to see a counselor today and I was super nervous because the last time I saw a counselor she pretty much was telling me that like I'm not saying that you shouldn't go to school anymore but I'm saying that none of your credits are gonna transfer and like pretty much saying that I was gonna have to start over if I wanted to go to a university that I was gonna have to start from skirt one and I was just like what like I've been in college for five years I don't know what to do now and then the counselor that I saw today she pretty much was saying like that that counselor was really wrong and all my credits align for an AA degree so I could technically graduate with an AA degree within maybe I don't know the next two or three years maybe at the most and I was just like are you kidding me literally she was saying like pretty much like I had to start over from one like square one and I was just like so stressed out and I was like ready to cry but then this counselor was telling me like reassuring me like no like if you retake the classes that you took last semester since I failed them because of my whole wrist thing my wrist surgery and all that stuff um she was like so you're a music major but I see that you have d's and f's in your music classes why is that and I was like well I got hit by a car and I had to explain the whole thing and it was like super embarrassing it's kind of like it's kind of like you're like, oh, you're a photographer, but you don't have any cameras. Or like, you're an actress, but you don't act. It was like super, super embarrassing to me. When she was like, oh, you're a music major, but you have D's and F's in your music classes from last semester. Why is that? And I was like, it wasn't my fault. I don't know. I don't know what to say. But yeah, I was super, super feeling anxious before. And I took my calming aromatherapy spray out of my bag. And I was like, I don't need it I needed it and then I took my amethyst crystal out of my bag and I was like I don't need it I needed it but then I remembered I had my citrine um, crystal in my wallet which is supposed to help with abundance and focus and pretty much like getting things done and I was like you know what it's meant to be that I'm only supposed to have this citrine so like everything's gonna balance out today everything's gonna be focused everything's gonna go exactly how it needs to go and be planned the way it needs to be planned and so I have three classes for next semester which I normally have classes on Monday Wednesdays but now I have classes Monday Wednesday and Thursday this semester which is kind of weird because I only like having classes on Monday and Wednesdays so I only have specific school days you know and I normally have like an open schedule so it's kind of like nerve-wracking to tell my manager like oh hey like I can't work on Mondays Wednesdays and also on Thursdays so schedule me anytime other than that and I don't know, I'm gonna, everything's gonna change this semester. It's gonna be really weird, but I knew that a change was coming because I could just feel it. I don't know how, like, I don't know how to explain it, but I literally could just feel change. At the beginning of summer, I just knew, like, a whole bunch of things were gonna change, and it felt so uncomfortable. But if you wanna be comfortable, then you're not gonna grow. You're not gonna get out of your norm you're gonna obviously stay in your comfort zone but as soon as you get uncomfortable as soon as you do things that you're not used to doing that's when you grow that's when you learn things that's when you decide to pretty much spread your wings explore adventure 
gain more knowledge literally everything like your mind expands just like so many things happen when you get out of your comfort zone and I could just feel it and I was kind of like stressing out about it not wanting to get out of my comfort zone but then I finally released myself and was just like you know what if this is what's meant to be que sera sera so <laughs> that's definitely not how you say it but I said it like that anyways um, also update on my hand it definitely still hurts they told me not to peel these off and they said for them to come off by themselves but it looks kind of gross I'm not gonna peel it off though because they told me not to um, but last gratitude of today I am just so thankful that I got the counselor that I got I'm so thankful that I talked to the financial aid office they let me know that I have a bog fee waiver so I do not have to pay for classes this semester I just have to pay for books and pretty much transportation and stuff like that and like groceries all the adulting stuff but I'm literally so grateful that everything went the way that it did today and I was so I wasn't stressed this morning but I was like more anxious than normal and um, yeah now that it's over <laughs> I know that what I was feeling about the change it's actually real change is coming soon and it's gonna be great next semester is gonna be super out of my comfort zone it's just gonna be weird but it's gonna be good it's gonna be good I'm super excited for it but anyways thank you guys for staying for this little sit down talk video I had pre-filmed like two or three videos but I just feel like this video is the video that needs to come up or be posted so hopefully this helped someone out there with something that they were trying to struggle or they were kind of struggling with today or something the reason why I felt like it needed to be posted I'm going with my gut and my intuition because it's telling me to post this video but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had a great day and it was productive. I hope that your New Year's resolutions aren't resolutions anymore. They are goals that have become exactly what they need to be. Give up on giving up in 2018 and I'll see you guys in three days. Bye. Also, if you're watching this right this second, go to um, younow.com slash my testimony. I think underscore 1995. I'll put a link down below. I am live streaming. So I'll see you guys in my live stream. Bye.